all about birds for kids. Birds are a class of vertebrates, the aves. They are warm-blooded and lay eggs. Their bodies are covered with feathers and they have wings. Feathers have three functions, flight, temperature regulation and display. Most birds have hollow main bones with air sacs in them. This makes them lighter and makes flight easier. Birds are bipedal, they have two legs which are often covered with scales, small, flat plates which overlap in the same way as feathers. They have a hard beak with no teeth. Because birds keep a high body temperature, they use lots of energy. So, they need to eat a lot of food compared with their weight. More than 9,000 different species of birds are known. Birds are found on every continent of the world. Birds of different types can live in freezing cold environments, and others can live in hot deserts. Birds live in forests, in grasslands, on cliff faces, in river banks, on stony seashores, down mine shafts and in the roofs of houses. Different types of birds eat different foods. Most birds are carnivorous meaning that they eat flesh, at least some of the time. Many birds live on insects or on fish. Some eat small reptiles and mice. Birds of prey, mammals and other birds. Some birds are scavengers and eat the bodies of creatures that have died. Many birds such as parrots and finches live on seeds and fruit. Some birds that eat mainly seeds feed their young on insects. A few types of birds eat green plants, but only one species lives on leaves, the huatsin. Hummingbirds and homeeaters live on nectar or honey and flowers. Birds come in many sizes from the bee hummingbird that is only 60 millimeters long to the ostrich which stands 2.5 meters high. The bird with the widest wingspan is the wandering albatross many of which measure 3 meters from tip to tip. All this applies to living birds. Birds are the descendants of their robber dinosaurs and the early birds looked much like small carnivorous dinosaurs. Much is now known about the origin of birds. From fossils we know that these dinosaurs had feathers, and early birds had teeth. The smallest types of birds are tiny birds that feed on nectar, honey and insects. The biggest birds are flightless birds with long legs, ostriches, emus and cassowaries. However, very large birds are also found soaring high in the sky, eagles, vultures, albatross and pelicans. One way to understand the living habits of a bird is to look at its legs and feet, its beak, its neck and its wings. If a bird has very long legs, then it probably spends most of its time walking, like a crane, or wading, walking in water, like a flamingo. Birds with long legs need long necks to match, so they can reach their food. Birds with short legs and long necks like pelicans, geese and swans are birds that swim well and dive their heads into the water for food. Their beaks are often flat for scooping up water weeds. A pelican's beak can change into a shape like a huge bucket for catching fish. 